Hey guys, this is Versatile from Game Dexterity. So in today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use DOSBox, which is a DOS um, emulation program in Windows. It allows you to run old school DOS games. And in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install this game called Harvester. Actually, this is a tutorial request for Filter Girl 8 because this particular person said on my other DOSBox video that um, they did not know how to install this game in DOSBox. So here is this tutorial for you. So Basically, bottom line, if you're new, go to DOSBox.com, click on the Downloads here, and then click on Windows, if you're using Windows, of course, Download and Install. So, let's, I already did that, so to help save some time. And also, another thing that I have done so far, because some people were complaining my other DOSBox tutorials, fine, whatever, is I have a Harvester folder, and I have three ISOs here. So I already have the first ISO mounted, Disk 1. You may have a physical disk. This game is actually three disk. Ugh. I know, but anyways, I have it in the digital form, so I have the first disk mounted. So in order to do that, just right click and mount it with um, Virtual Clone Drive. I got another tutorial on that if you're so inclined. This is the contents of my H drive, my virtual drive. So this is the contents of the first disk. And then also on my C drive, I made a new folder called Old Games. You can make your own folder. The reason I call it Old Games is just for an organizational type thing, which will make more sense in the video. So let's do that right now. So let's run DOSBox. And I'm using and launch if anyone's curious out there. So first thing we want to do is mount the CD-ROM drive. So this is how we're going to do it. Mount and letter D. D is arbitrary, but I'm just going to call it the letter D for the, the virtual CD-ROM drive. Okay. Now I'm going to say H colon backslash. Remember, H is the name of my physical drive. So if I go to my computer, for example, I have uh, the game mounted in this H drive. Your game may be a letter D or a letter E. I don't know. Whatever your CD drive letter is, put it in the DOS box program. So H and then dash T and then CD-ROM. Sweet. Now we want to mount the C drive. So mount, oops, mount C and then C colon slash old games. Remember, this is the directory where I have my old games folder. Your folder may be somewhere totally different on your PC. So make sure you update it accordingly. Press enter. Okay, we're, we're good. So now let's go to D drive. And let's type DIR because I don't know everything there is about this particular game. Now I do know that this is a DOS game. So let's type install. And this window comes up. That's fine. Press enter. Let's do a full install. Press enter. And enter again. And it installs it to the C harvest folder. Enter to continue. And enter to continue. And that's it. So now if you want to play, play the game, you type in harvest. And I'll show you a real quick proof of this working. Now I'm using Camtasia to record so I may lag a little bit in terms of the sounds but at least you get the basic idea here. So let's skip some of these scenes here in the beginning and I never played this game before but I heard it's a very good old school game. So here I am and um, oh look at this there's a kid here. What? Yeah. Who are you? Leave me alone, Steve, or I'll tell mom on you. Oh, this guy's a pedophile. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to press escape, and we're going to uh, go to quit game and say yes. So let's type exit, okay? Now, this is where someone's going to ask, Versatile, what do I do to run this game again in the future? All right, fine. So let's go back to DOSBox, right? And this is the wrong way of doing this. So let's say you go mount C, C colon dash, old games, right? And you go to C drive, right? And you do DIR. And then here you see, you notice a game folder called Harvest. So you do CD, oops, sorry, Harvest, right? And now you type in Harvest. And what's going to happen is it's going to give you this error about you don't have your CD round drive mounted. See? You see this? So this is where you have to be smart and remember, hey, remember what Versatile said? So we're going to do this. We're going to do mount D H colon um, backslash like that, dash T, CD ROM. Where H is my real CD ROM drive. You may have a totally different letter, like an E or F or whatever. And now, if I type in harvest, the game is going to run. Come on. See? It runs. See? So, pretty cool. Good times here. Um, if you want to kill DOSBox, I guess you could press, you know, you know, escape until you get to quit game. Say yes. And then you can say quit here. Oops, sorry, exit. And there you go. So that's the tutorial in a nutshell. If you like this type of video, please like, fair, and subscribe so that hopefully one day we can get on the front page of YouTube. Otherwise, if you've got any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here on the YouTube page, and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.